Good morning, friends. Once again, it's time to pray for the nations. Let's pray. Father in heaven, once again, Father, we want to commit the nations into your hand. Thank you for this wonderful morning. We want to praise you, Lord, for this wonderful weather. We continue to pray for the vaccination program, not only in Malaysia, but throughout the world, that you continue to go on safely. That the numbers of those who are been infected will go down. We thank you that the numbers are going down in Malaysia. Yesterday, 5,000 over cases only. We continue to pray, Father, that the, the people will continue to follow SOP, take it seriously. We pray for those, especially the elderly, who have signs or symptoms of this sickness. They will quickly go to the hospital, to be quarantined hospital instead of at home because we understand that there are many now they have been brought in dead. That is, before they arrive in hospital, they are dead. Father, therefore, we pray, Lord, in the name of Jesus, we pray against every kind of COVID variant, and we pray, Lord, that you continue to protect the people all over the world, of oh God, from death, that they will not go into eternity without knowing the Lord Jesus Christ, O oh God, and that you will continue to quicken and step up this vaccination production and the vaccination program then all over the world, oh God, the people will get vaccinated. And not only that, Father, we pray that the people will learn to fear you and follow you, Lord, and obey you, Lord, and that they will receive Jesus as the Lord and Savior, that they will be safe. Because this is not only life in this world that's important, but rather it's eternal life that's important, oh God. Therefore, we pray for the Prince of Peace to be upon all the people. Pray that they receive Jesus as Lord and Savior. Continue to pray for the G7 nations that are having their meetings, O oh God. We pray they will grant wisdom unto the G7s, O oh God, that they will not compete or do anything, O oh God, in competition, but rather, Lord, think of means of uh, restoring the economy, that there will be peace throughout the world, that the gospel will continue to prosper, in that atmosphere of peace, O oh God. We pray that this COVID, you use it, O oh God, to turn the nations around, that they will learn to fear you, seek after you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.